A traditional rope walking system can be pretty expensive. Uh, traditionally, you know, you've got a foot ascender, you've got a knee ascender or a sokka, but neither of those, they're both getting you up the rope, but neither of them act as actual points of life support. So now you need to be truly safe an additional two points of contact for life support. What we've got here is a modified microfrog system. So uh, traditionally with a microfrog system, you've got a foot ascender, uh, and so a foot ascender can typically go for about $80, but if you wait to get one on sale, I got this one here for $50 at Tree Stuff. Now, uh, the second piece is often here, you've got a point of life support, which is gonna be some sort of self-tending camming device. Um, and a typical micro frog will often have a pencil crawl, which that can go for also again about $80, $90. And what I've got here, is called the Wild Country Rope Man. This is the Rope Man 2. The Rope Man 1, uh, instead of having teeth, has little uh, ridges, so it's probably gonna be nicer on your rope. Um, this one I got on sale. They normally go for $50, but this was $40. Uh, and so that attaches to the rope. And then this little wire tether here is just so that it can uh, self-tend, and that is attached here to a chest harness. Now this chest harness is not life support. You can buy these for about $40 um, or you can also make one really easily with just some flat webbing. It's super simple. Um, doesn't Nothing too complicated. Now for your third point of attach in a traditional micro frog system is a very tiny handle descender that will attach to the rope. However, I don't find it to be very ergonomic, especially for my big hands. So what I've gone for instead is just a regular traditional handle descender, uh, and this one I was also able to get on sale. Normally they run at about eighty to a hundred dollars or more. I paid fifty-seven uh, for this guy here. Um, so between the handle of the sender, the, the rope man, and the foot ascender, it was a hundred and fifty dollars. Doesn't really get much better than that. Now this handle of the sender. Um, is basically, I've attached this uh, piece of 7 mil cord to it to create an adjustable uh, QAS system. This is just a standard Blake's hitch. Uh, it's coming through this SMC micro pulley, which uh, they're pretty cheap as far as micro pulleys go. I think I got it for $15 on sale as well. And it allows you to, once you get up to the top of the tree, you can pull up on this and shorten up that system. So on here, we've got this foot loop, which this is some retired tubular webbing. It's not life support, so that's okay. I've had it for over 10 years and I've just sewn a little loop in there. It doesn't have to be anything fancy, you know, just as so long as it'll, uh, you can stand on it and it's not gonna blow. So to get started here, I will uh, put my rope man on the rope. Just like that. And so this will tend the rope man and otherwise I don't have to do anything with it. So I can just go ahead and sit on that to make sure that my system is holding. Then I'll go ahead and attach my adjustable QAS, get that on up there. Attach your foot ascender. Put your other foot in the loop. You're ready to go.